Trex is essentially a, a training model uh, that allows us to have a very condensed classroom to provide training to wildland firefighters in a prescribed fire setting, in a controlled burn setting. In the wildland fire world, we have certain training uh, and certain qualifications that we all have to achieve in order to uh, become more responsible, in order to uh, learn more about fire and learn more about leadership. And the opportunities to train in order to achieve those qualifications are often limited at best. So this training exchange really provides uh, an opportunity for people to address some of those bottlenecks at the level in which you're managing people and you're managing people doing work. We're trying to address those bottlenecks with this prescribed fire training exchange in the Southern Blue Ridge and using this model across the country to address it nationwide as well. TREX trainings are really unique in that they are run like a wildland fire incident. We all gather here from all over the world, really, for 14 days, and everything we do, we do in unison. So the ability to see different parts of the country, to see and meet people from all over the world and hear about how they burn versus how we may burn here. The ability to learn on the fly, on the ground, while putting fire on the ground is a fabulous thing and that's where the learning really happens is out here in the woods with a drip torch in our hands. We have people from all over the United States representing various states and state agencies and federal agencies as well as private uh, organizations. We have participants from Spain. We have participants from Costa Rica as well that have joined us here just for this two weeks at an opportunity to gather some good training, to network, and to understand and appreciate the ecology of the local area. All of the participants in the treks are officially certified wildland firefighters. They all fight fire in different capacities, maybe at state levels, maybe at federal levels, and how have varying degrees of experience. But for them to come here and work together and put fire down on the ground in a controlled way is very beneficial to their training. It helps them get the training they need to further their wildland fire career as well as the training they need to put more prescribed fire on the ground in their part of the country. This training exchange allows us the opportunity to, to try and increase the fire footprint in the landscape, but also to build local capacity among the state agencies and the federal agencies both in North Carolina and South Carolina, as well as regionally. I wanted to bring the treks here to the Southern Blue Ridge. Number one, I grew up 20 minutes down the road. I have the great privilege of managing the lands that I grew up around with fire for the benefit of the land. I also wanted to bring people here to the Southern Blue Ridge to see and experience the type of fire we use and how we put it on the ground and the, the partnerships and uh, successes we have here. And also I wanted to be able to share with the participants here the science behind it all. We don't just walk out there and put fire on the ground. There are reasons, and those reasons are tied to animals and vegetation and fuels. And to be able to integrate that into their learning experience is key in understanding fire, how to put it on the ground, where to put it on the ground, and when to put it on the ground. We understood that fire played a critical role in getting the natural vegetation back to where it should be. Um, and so we uh, talked um, with the state parks to in, encourage more fire in, in the state parks and so we started burning actually last year we burned on several state parks and Table Rock has a couple uh, units or tracks on it that we want to burn um, and so that brought in all the partners and cooperators that we've been working with to um, bring in the the treks which is a training effort that brings in people that are interested in learning more about prescribed fire and how to run it as it within the incident management system. I've always said that everything I know about fire I've learned on a fire and TREX really embodies that. The essence of TREX is to get out there and actually use fire on the ground during the experience. None of us can do this alone. The need for fire is much greater than what one agency or one organization can shoulder by themselves and it takes building partnerships it takes having relationships and deep relationships with these agencies. And this training exchange, it's not only about the training and the qualification, it's about strengthening those relationships. When we succeed, we all succeed together. And this is our effort and partnership with various agencies and organizations to work together, to partner together, uh, to put this TREX on and to have it succeed.